I have an outstanding stat to share with you that will back up my belief that this proves that WB knows that Cody Rhodes is the true, real top guy on Monday Night Raw, not Seth Rollins. And it's not just because he's pushed all over the place on Raw and SmackDown. It's not because he sells a lot of merchandise, more than most. It's not because of his TV ratings increasing every time he appears on television. No, this stat will back this up, and I think you'll agree. Cody Rhodes is a guy that made his return to the WWE in 2022, ironically beating Seth Rollins at WrestleMania 38 and then going on and beating him two more times on premium live events. Heck, he worked a Hell in a Cell match with Seth Rollins with a torn peck for making his return to WWE in 2023 at the Royal Rumble and going on and yet falling short to our tribal chief, Roman Reigns, for the undisputed WWE Championship. In the main event, after everyone and their dog thought that Cody Rhodes was going to be the guy that not only dethroned Roman Reigns, but finally got that world championship that he's been looking for his entire career. He didn't get it in AEW. He has yet to get it in WB. And really, in 2023, Cody Rhodes has been the workhorse of the company. And while, yes, they brought back the World Heavyweight title, and yes, they gave the championship to Seth Rollins, who's done a remarkable job with the booking that they've given him, working against guys like Finn Balor and Shinsuke Nakamura. Cody Rhodes is a guy that has consistently been there week in, week out, night in, night out, show in, show out, media appearance, and media appearance. And so Wrestle Features, which is a great follow on Twitter, they shared an interesting stat. Now, Cody Rhodes and Jey Uso had recently won the undisputed WB Universal Tag Team Championships at Fastlane, no less, from the Judgment Day. And they gave... Back to the titles. They did the honors for the Judgment Day on the October 16th, 2023 episode of Monday Night Raw. And the account noted that the loss for Rhodes in this tag team match on Raw was his only fourth defeat since returning to WB in 2022. And more interestingly enough, he has only been pinned on one occasion since returning to WB. That shows you Everything you need to know about what WB thinks of Cody Rhodes. Yes, they push him like no other. And yes, he does make a lot of media appearances for them. And while they used to love to tout that wins and losses don't matter, I'm sorry, they do. And I'll show you to people like Roman Reigns, Gunther, and when she still had the Raw Women's Champion, Bianca Belair. WB protects who want who they want to protect, not what they want to tell you. If they think highly of you, they will book you strong. Never forget CM Punk's famous words when talking about working with the Shield before his WB departure. You got to make Roman look really, really strong. Well, you got to make Cody Rhodes really, really strong. 